Hey guys, it's Jonathan Mead, and it's day two of the Found My Flexibility Challenge. I hope day one went well for you. If you haven't yet, make sure you watch that video because it uh, explains a lot of the concepts and a lot of the principles that we're using in this challenge. You're gonna get a lot more out of this if you make sure you go back and watch that video. Um, for today, we are going to focus on twisting movements. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna lie face up on your back, and again, just checking in with your breathing, make sure you're feeling your body before you're trying to change it. Because that's what we're trying to do with stretching. We're trying to increase our range of motion, expand our range of motion. So today we're gonna explore reaching with the legs and the arms with twisting movements. So I'm reaching my leg up, reach it over to the ground, try to touch it on the ground. It's okay if my uh, back lifts, but try to keep that down. And then I reach all the way to the side, and I'm just gonna repeat this about six, seven times. And again, I'm exploring the movement, right? I'm really feeling my body. I'm not just going through the motions. So a lot of times we don't get the results that we want from our training because we're just kind of calling it in, right? We're phoning it in. We're not really being there, being present. The other leg comes up, same thing. Reaching, twisting. So feel if you can reach a little further with your big toe. So you're reaching out, opening up, and then I'm reaching up overhead all the way as far as I can this way. So I'm reaching. Connect with that area of your body that has to activate in order to stay strong while that reach is happening. Okay, so now you bent, drop that all the way to the side. And from here now I'm gonna do the same thing but with my arms. So reaching over opening up this is going to be a really good stretch for your upper back for your chest reaching really try to control the movement as much as possible so don't just fall down you know really be mindful when you're moving good repeat that on the other side Opening and closing. And feel free to explore too, right? You could reach up, you could reach down, you can reach over this way. Whatever helps you be a little bit more active in it and fights that boredom response, I really encourage you to do because movement can be really pleasure, pleasurable and when we're connecting with that sense of pleasure, we're gonna get more out of it. We're gonna wanna do it more. Okay, so from here, now I'm going to explore just reaching my arm up and my leg down, so straightening and bending. I talked about this a little bit in the first day of the challenge, but this reaching principle is really all that stretching is. And repeat that on the other side. I what would we do this for, right? We'd probably be in, if we were living our natural lifestyle, we'd be reaching to get something. Like we'd be reaching to pick a fruit or reaching on the ground to pick something up, you know, dig something out of the ground. So just something, a little mind food for you to think about. The last movement we're gonna do is coming up into a kind of a squat. And it's okay if you can't hold a squat yet. Um, you can plant your hand down and we're just gonna twist and reach over. Get this knee or my elbow into my knee. Twist and reach, look overhead. It really helps to find something to look at when you're trying to deepen a stretch like this. So find a point where you're looking toward and then repeat the other side. And I'm just gonna cycle through this a few times. Okay. 
making sure I'm still breathing while I am moving. So we don't twist enough in our modern lives uh, just because we don't have a reason to, right? We've outsourced that movement uh, to other things like the, you know, the backup camera in our cars. Uh, maybe you don't have one. My car has one, um, but I actively just ignore that and intentionally look behind me. So getting more twisting in your life is really, really good for you. I encourage you to uh, really explore this movement, have fun with it, and definitely use the hashtag uh, found my flexibility. When you post this, uh, you'll get a chance to uh, win one of the memberships in the course. And as always, let me know if you have any questions or comments, anything I can help with, and I'll see you in day three.